What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Um, if you can't tell, today we're playing Dungeons of Eternity. This game just came out. Um, I played it already a little bit with my friends. It is insanely good. I can't believe how well this looks just on standalone Quest 2. But enough talking. Let's get right into a dungeon. Alright, let's do this. A key right off the bat. Oh wow. That is some stick drift. <laughs> Alright. You're dead. So a friend of mine actually bought me this game, because I mentioned it to him. And he was nice enough to buy it for me. So thank you. Alright, well we already found our first chest. And I hope we got a key. Oh, I just love how well that works. It's so cool. What am I going to get? 100 coins? Ooh, a damage potion. <gasps> That's my first unique item. Now we got to get this dungeon, dude. We got we to gotta finish it to actually unlock that. Get the coins. That's a no-no barrel. We don't like those. So, if you didn't know, this game is multiplayer and can be up to three people in your dungeon with you. Which is awesome, but one thing I want to mention is that me and my friend have actually been having some multiplayer issues. Um, the game did just come out, obviously, but there's gonna be there's gonna be issues. It's not gonna be perfect. There, I hate those guys. Oh, I got the key. Oh, I didn't mean to grab it. But yeah, yesterday we were having a little bit of con connection issues, and I don't know if that was just on our end or the game, but. We're still, we're, still, we're still having fun out here, guys, alright? There's bosses in this game, there's... God dang, that guy's stupid. No, I died! What hit me? What killed me? Since we lost that last round, we didn't get to keep what was in this chest, so we got to do it again. See what we get this time. Ooh, I got more coins this time. An ice bomb. Ooh, another unique weapon. All right, we're back here. The wizards are my worst enemy in this game. That really hurt, dude. I don't know if a lot of you guys out there knew, but this game did come out with the release of the Quest 3? Or is it the Meta Quest Pro or something like that? I don't know what it's called. I've been hearing a lot of good things about it. I, I do hope I get to try it eventually. Ow. Oh, right handing it. These ghouls are annoying. They're strong as crap. Cool thing about the game is that you can shoot their legs out and they become crawlers. Oh, frick. Ow. This game is physics based, which is really cool. Reminds me a lot of, uh, like a mix between battle talent and, uh, D&D &D or. Blade Sorcery. Oh god, you scared the crap out of me. You wrecked, sucker. Alright. Jumped off my arrow. So right now, if you guys can't already tell, I'm trying to go for more of like an archer ranger build. Um, range in this game does come in handy. A lot. And I'm not kidding when I say that. <gasps> Another chest. This is the only other key I have. I gotta find more. What's the loot looking like? Yes. 
Oh! I didn't know there was crossbows in this game. So, if you didn't know, there is boss fights in this game, which makes it really, really entertaining to fight, especially with friends. Another thing I want to mention with this game is that all of his dungeons are randomly generated, so you're never going to get into a dungeon that's exactly... Well, I mean, you might get into a dungeon that's exactly the same, but that's really rare, because everything's randomly generated, which makes it awesome. Okay, we're good. I missed. Oh, what? This place is massive! I've never been in a place an area like this. He just blocked my arrow with his face. Oh, hi there. Why are you walking towards me menacingly? One thing I would be kind of interested in seeing is like... Like a harder difficulty where you have a limited amount of arrows and like smaller amounts of health. I don't know. <laughs> that would make it pretty cool and interesting. Ow! This is where the key goes. We have that. Should open that door right there. Booyah. The cool thing about those ghouls is that you can actually cut their arms and limbs off. And emo demobil what is it, immobilize? Incapacitate? Whatever. Oh, those are traps, as you can tell. Go off, you're scaring me. Okay. Okay, we're good. Do I have a key on me? I do, I have two. Cool thing about these doors is that you can actually get close and look into them. That looks like a trap. Um, I've actually never seen that before, but that's definitely a trap. So we're gonna open it and move. If it is a trap. What if I duck? I'm scared. Oh frick, he's- Okay, these bats are dangerous guys, I'm not even kidding. They're actually really hard to hit. Since this game is physics based, you actually have to- hit, Like, they don't have a big, hit, a big hitbox, you have to actually hit them. So with the bats, if you miss, you're screwed. And they're fast as crap. Crap, there's a bat. Oh, there's multiple. Oh my- Ow. Where is it? Oh my gosh, dude. My bow was getting stuck on my sword. Oh, get away from me. Shields are really helpful when you're going with a melee build. Just in case there's another one. Alright, and we're through. Alright, we're looking good on health. We got 578 coins, we got an ice bomb, power, and a haste potion. Those will come in handy. Extra loot. I don't like the look of this room, guys. What's in here? Well, there's only one way to find out, I guess. Hello? Anybody here? I'll take that key. Any more keys in here? That's glitched. One thing I would love to see is like a, a pull away book. <gasps> what? No! Oh. Alright guys, so that's exactly what I mean by this game just came out. There's still bugs in it. I just fell through that. But that's fine. That's expected. That table doesn't even work. Oh my chill, dude. How do you jump with bones? Once you find the recon drone, which is this thing right here, you hold A and you activate the last challenge, some would say. Uh, this is what brings you back to your base with all your loot. Let's start this, guys. Find the batteries to power up the drone. So we need one, two, and three batteries. Event has started. Batteries drop from enemies. Let's do this. Okay, the first guy usually drops the first battery. Put it up to it. Drop it in. One battery down. Two more to go.
There are rangers too. I think I've seen a oh battery. Okay, we got the second battery. We're looking good. Typically at the end of these, there's usually a little boss. He's usually the last guy to fight. Oh shoot! Okay. Yeah, that's one of the bosses, guys. It's he's strong as crap. This is why you need range, because these strong guys are no joke. That was way easier than the last time I fought him. So we can either from here leave the battery there, put it in when we're done, or we can go check for the rooms. But for the sake of the video, I'm just gonna leave. Put that in. Gets repaired. Sweet. We gotta work in recon. Get to the teleporter zone. So once you walk into this little blue circle, you can teleport it back to the lobby. With that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If so, please make sure to subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. Helps the channel grow. And make sure you like the video if you enjoyed. But with that, see ya. Peace. Happy Halloween. And have a good day. Bye.